Hello everyone, today I'm going to show you about cell provenance sinus thrombosis imaging. The immunology pathology formation in cell provenance and sinuses. Presentation, increase intracranial pressure, added nausea vomiting, visual disturbance, after mental status, parenchymal injury, seizure, focal neurology, deficit, Cavernous sinus thrombosis leading to cranial nerve palsy. Clinical sign, papillary edema. Liver property, uh, risk factor infection, such as problem like disease, acute illness, dehydration, thrombophilia, cancer, trauma, and medication. Imaging, non contrasting in CT, acute thrombus is usually hyper than more than 58 on field unit. On field unit, an HCT ratio is more than 1.4 in case sensitivity milk for associated edema plus minus hemorrhage. CTD, feeling the effects of legs of classification. Which in sinus venous, I'm going to be aware of multiple. Slow flow on pin ecosic from in plant flow on time of flies. TL. T2. Lack of flow voice in affected vessel flare. Vessel at the mouth in parenchyma. T2 style SWI blobbing. In area of thrombosis, DWIs look for area of venous in fact is in red. CDT1, G, or in C plus filling effect or non opacification within sinus, venous, plus minus dura and leptomeningeal enhancement, PWI, plus minus other area of perfusion. Arm or V, legs of flow related signal in affected vessel. CD, T1, C plus, F, S, arm or V, 17 over on oral contraceptive, so lack of enhancement in the superior signal sinus consists with sinus thrombosis, not the normal ossification of the Sigmoid sinus. Contraction in CT in the two years old with mastoiditis, so a classification of the right mastoid and subperiosteal abscess. There is no contrast in the right sigmoid sinus consistent with thrombos compared to the not more like sigmoid sinus. Non contrast in NCT in the one year old with left pressure drop, so hyperattenuation in the bilateral internal cerebral vein and vein of cardiac. Also, note the decreased attenuation and swelling of the right thalamus. DWI in the same patient, so an enlarged right thalamus and clouded head with area of the shoes restriction often referred to as venous infarction. These terms should be used with caution, however, as the diffuse restriction can result without imaging Scale. Treatment, anticoagulation, provoke thrombosis, three to six months, and provoke spontaneous thrombosis, six to five months, severe thrombophilia, lifetime therapy, rarely thrombolysis may be used if critically ill and refractory to anticoagulation. Thank you.